we were actually going to talk about where social media is in commercial real estate. What is, what is the adoption? Where do you see it going and why? It's interesting to talk about that here because I've been coming to the Crew Network conventions for many years and there was a time a few years ago when a couple of us would tweet at the convention. Crew Network has really uh, adopted Twitter in particular as their main platform and has promoted the use in all the sessions and created the event hashtag Rewards of Risk. And um, the number of distinct individuals here who are tweeting on behalf of their business, their local chapter, uh, the industry themselves, it's, it's pretty high. Now people are tweeting here. They are. But have you made any judgment on the quality of the tweets? Judgment on the quality of the tweets, well, uh, certainly there, there is some running commentary about sessions, which is helpful if you have a conflict of sessions and you can't go to both this morning. That would morning. be high quality. Yes, high quality. There's even some repetition, which again speaks to the mm -hmm. numbers of people who are getting aha moments from speakers. This morning, Steve Forbes spoke and he was very engaging, um, a funnier man about monetary policy than we would normally imagine. So Howard, back to social media. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> you and I met through Twitter, but yes. here we are meeting in real life, and that's the beauty of social media is getting, making these connections for business development, for furthering your goals, and um, crew network and I together will be doing a Twitter webinar next month uh, that we're developing to help some of our members who have been slower to adopt or understand the value in making those connections to commercial real estate, CRE particularly and more of a tutorial, more of a basic how-to to get more people on board. When we met, yes. at first I didn't recognize you and you go, really? you're looking at me like, it's Barbie. That's right. Oh, and we had never met before, but yeah. we knew each other. We did. We knew each other before we actually met in person and that is the beauty of social media. You develop relationships. I was so shocked when that started happening. Uh, even it, people like mm -hmm. J.W. Nigerian and... Alan Buchanan has referred business to us locally right. in Tucson, so that's Al a Alan, That's thing. how Alan and I met. And when you finally meet in person, which is part of it, it, it's so more meaningful because you know the person before you actually meet them. And that's what validates the value of social media for leadership in firms that previously may not have gotten it uh, when transactions happen, when uh, relationships and referrals happen. For more information about our sponsors, click on the highlighted links. If you're interested in becoming a sponsor and having your logo behind me for thousands of people to see, contact me at sponsor at CREradio.com or click on the highlighted link.